What is the crack lads and welcome back to the channel. So Konami have released a brand new trailer to launch season 2 proper and obviously this was due to you know everything launching on the 16th which is today. Um, we're going to go through the trailer. There's a couple of cool bits in it. There's a couple of things I want you guys to let me know your opinions on. It starts us off with Neymar and as you can see here lads I mean the colors everything is just like a bit crazy and a bit mad and you've got drones flying around the place. It looks like a bit of I don't know, Metal Gear Solid style. There's drones flying around the place. Neymar is doing tricks. Um, there's a lot of effects and graphics on screen. And then we get introduced to the new cards. So there's a couple of new cards coming here. And it seems to be like an evolution of Neymar's career. So it starts us off with the young, youthful look of Neymar with the big mad mohawk um, bleached. And then that's a level 88 card. Now, I'm not too sure if this is just an evolved version of that card. Or if this is a brand new card, because it could be a different image on the same card that you that you upgrade, you know, when you play over, uh, train the players or whatever. Um, but it could be two different cards as well from two different seasons. It's not 100% confirmed yet, um, but that might tie in because the next card is obviously a Barcelona one. So 92 overall Barcelona card, as you can see there, is quite nice. And then we've got the Brazil card. Um, which we saw last, I think that was like a pre-order type thing that you could get as well. So just go back to that one there a second ago, right lads? Because it kind of went very quick. The Barcelona one is obviously, I think, going to tie in to eventually more Barcelona legends coming. Because obviously that they do have the Barcelona license. I think that they're going to expand on that. But that is probably going to be one of the best cards to get. Because that is when Neymar was going to be in his prime, right? And he's 92 overall. Um, but the biggest card coming up here is quite a, like... This is what I'm talking about with Dream Team, right? So look at this for a card, man. This, like, I don't know if this is going to actually release. I ho like, I hope it does because it looks sick. Um, it looks like a Super Saiyan kind of Dragon Ball Z kind of mad card, um, anime style, superhero style. Um, and this is something that I've talked about like for a while on other videos and in the podcasts and stuff. Um, if we go over here to check out this scene here, you'll see that NBA 2K do very similar style like they do a similar style to this you know and there's a lot of features in this that i think you know, like they, they could learn from from nba 2k so i'm glad if this is you know if this card is going to release um and it's going to be like a superhero version of neymar um like yeah i mean that's going to be the way that they go obviously and you can see some of the cards here like you've got a 99 overall michael jordan you've got a 96 shack 98 dirk um obviously these cards are going to be seriously high high rated and again you know if dream team isn't for you you're not going to enjoy um these cards you know what i mean it's as simple as that you're not going to enjoy these cards you're going to be you're like wanting your offline modes and whatever but at the moment this is this is where they're going with it you know this is what they're doing with dream team so i'm going to be interested to see do they actually release that card or is it just kind of for the trailer um but it does look kind of cool to be fair um depending on whether you want to sign high rated players or not i think when when the filters come into the game and you can play like a level three squad i think that's when you'll really start to see dream team come to you know it's 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 four then it clicks on a transition nice little uh, graphic there to r10 r10 is in the trailer he's on the beach he's just chilling out behind his house beast and doesn't look a day older than the day he retired and we've got a ronaldinho featured card here so this is very similar to his uh, his image that's already there and was in pez 2021 as well but it's signed so you've got the the kind of signature card i think that these are being called um which is there and obviously this transitions back in here to the drones metal gear solid style and then we're on a, an island right so the drones has escaped the island they're going back to the uh, e-football stadium and then we get a look at the club championship players so that release so up in meccano and a couple of the new uh cards that they had up in meccano there's a couple of little highlights here and then these seem to be all about the players that are you know they partnered or the ambassador ambassador players for eFootball this year so you're talking about Ansu Fati up in Meccano um and all those guys uh Kiesa all those guys so yeah I mean look it's a different type of trailer I think from Konami we go in here and we take a quick look at um a behind the scenes look into the training ground and into the into the uh into Manchester United's pitch as you can see there into their training ground you can see or not the training ground i should say the locker room let's sorry um and we get a quick zoom through that a quick zoom through that and then we're back out onto the pitch between a match and it seems to be that rashford is tearing up the pitch 
and about to bang one in. So again, the transition there is quite nice. We get his card, his celebration, and we also get his national team, which we're going to get a card for that, I would assume, as well. I mean, there's loads of cards coming, lads. I mean, this is kind of the direction that they're going. So, I mean, I know we're going to get people in the comments saying, like, like that like where's master league and all that but i mean this is the direction that they're going like this is this is what e-football is at the moment with dream team you know what i mean it's cards it's coins it's gp it's premium objectives it's creating your own squad um and you can see here that they've all got their own hand-picked squad so neymar has gone for a front three of him ronaldinho and ansu fatty with rashford as a cmf um or amf and that looks like a very attacking team. So there's no DMF there or no CMF, but Pika is there. Um, I'm not too sure who that goalie is, actually. Let me see if I can go back there and have a look at that goalie. I'm not too sure who it was, Liz. Maybe, maybe I'll spot it here. I can see who it is. It just says players. Okay, so that looks to be a new card as well, or else it doesn't say player, players of the year. That looks to be player of the year. So that's obviously going to be a new card that comes as well. So we've got player of the month, player of the week, player of the year. We've got strong defenders. We've got the featured edition of the clubs. And we've got Rashford there as a national team. We've got Neymar's special card. We've got Ronaldinho's card and uh, Ansu Fati as well. And then you can switch it up. There's a couple of different cards here that we can see. Um, it's kind of hard to make out a couple of them there. Um, but there is a couple of different cards there that you can see um if you if you if you strain yourself um but yeah i would be expecting a lot of cards to come lads to be honest with you we get a look at a couple of different celebrations and stuff uh ronaldinho in his classic kit and then neymar back we've already kind of seen trailers like that with the celebration so yeah lads look it's a different type of trailer um let me know what you guys think of the trailer let me know what you guys think of everything um as we as we um ended out there and uh yeah that is it from me just i mean like the thing for me like right as i said is if we go back to the trailer here and we take a look at neymar's card right like some people aren't going to like this stuff and i can i can totally see it especially as a long time fan of uh, a fan of you know pez and whatever but you know this is kind of where dream team is heading this is what the mode is all about so um let me know your thoughts let me know your thoughts on it that they're you know if this is if this is uh if this would you like to see this card do you like the direction they're going with the cards let me know what the crack is lads and uh we will be back soon peace